This is Twit. Now, if you're sitting in front of a Mac keyboard, listen up. An article on Dark Reading has detailed an expanded and enhanced malware campaign called Operation Intercept. It's aimed at Macs running on the M1 chip, and it's courtesy of our old friends, North Korea's own Lazarus Group. They're using some time-tested techniques in the new operation, and threat researchers at ESET have announced that they discovered a Mac executable camouflaged as a job description for an engineering manager position at Coinbase. According to the researchers, Lazarus actors used Brazil as the launch pad for this new malware. The root of the attack, a file called interception.dll, executes by loading three other files, PDF document with the fake Coinbase job posting, and two executables, finderfontsupdater.app and Safari Fonts Agent. Oh, and in case you're feeling saved by your own procrastination, the software can still attack Macs using the older Intel processors as well as the new M1 chips. So there's no joy in sitting around and waiting. Now, Interception has, we're told, been studied by ESET for the last three years. Originally, a very tightly targeted program thrown against aerospace companies is now being used against a much broader range of potential victims. Those victims find themselves the proud owner of a brand new data logger and business email compromise engine. As is often the case, North Korea is after data and specifically data that might be used for exfiltrating critical infrastructure files, critical defense files, and cryptocurrency. Fortunately, all is not lost. Last week, Apple revoked the certificate that would enable the malware to execute after ESET alerted the company of the campaign. So now, if you're running computers with Mac OS Catalina version 10.15 or later, you're protected, uh, assuming you use at least basic cybersecurity awareness.